Hey, what's up everyone, Bennett Profixer, and today I wanna to do something a little bit different here on the channel. Generally, we take a couple minutes to explain a full repair or do a product review like we have done in the past. What I wanted to do is take just one or two minutes to make a couple of videos that we're putting here on the channel to explain one point of a repair. As an example, today I'm gonna to show you how you can remove the headphone jack out of a Galaxy device or any other device that has one of these modular jacks that comes out. So, let's get started. One of the biggest bottlenecks that I see during Galaxy repairs is the modular headphone jack. A lot of the times the tech will remove the screw, then the flex, and then they'll proceed to take their screwdriver or any other pry tool that they have and try to pry on the back side of the uh, on the back side of the headphone jack to remove it from the housing. Pretty dangerous because if your screwdriver slips or anything else happens, you could damage the components on the inside of the housing, causing in some cases some pretty extensive damage especially on the newer ones that have the motherboard that extends all the way to the bottom of the phone in this particular instance the way that i do it to prevent any kind of uh, pry damage from happening is take your tool insert it as if it's uh, like a headphone and then pry backwards this will lift out the headphone jack completely safe and prevent any kind of pry damage that you could cause to the inside of the device inside the headphone jack there are no kind of contacts along that top ridge um, so you're not going to damage any of them as you pry up and it's really not a lot of force that you have to take whenever you plug it into the jack itself like that. Hopefully you found this tech tip useful. If you did, hit the like button. If not, the dislike button seems to work okay too. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as well, everything that I use in this video along with everything else that I use daily is linked up in the description below. So make sure you check those out so you can pick up some of these awesome tools that I use in all these videos. I'll see you later.